the signs test first let us see how to prepare sodium fusion extract so take a small piece of sodium and dry it well using filter paper and add this into a fusion tube and now we have to fuse this sodium into a silvery white button by gently waving this fusion tube in the flame add your sample next after adding this we have to now heat it strongly to red hot condition so once we have heated it to red hot condition we can plunge this fusion tube into the distilled water in a china dish and we have to grind this mixture well using a glass rod and now boil this and after boiling we have to filter this so this clear filtrate we call as sodium fusion extract so by fusing our substance with sodium metal here what is happening here the sodium is combining with carbon and nitrogen or with sulfur if the particular sample is having nitrogen or sulfur the sodium is combining with carbon and nitrogen to form sodium cyanide and it will be combining with sulfur to form sodium sulfide so next using this extract we can identify whether it is having nitrogen and sulfur so first test for nitrogen so take small amount of this sodium fusion extract in a test tube now add freshly prepared ferrous sulfate to this and we can boil this so after boiling we have to cool it and now we can add concentrated sulfuric acid so we can see the formation of prussian blue color that is due to the formation of ferric ferrocyanide complex that indicates the presence of nitrogen next test for sulfur so again here take a small amount of extract in a test tube and add two or three drops freshly prepared sodium nitroprusside solution and we can see a violet color here that is due to the formation of sodium thio nitroprusside so that indicates the presence of sulfur in the particular compound thank you